What's going on? <laughs> shout out, shout out y'all, how y'all doing? It's me, Shaky, MC Shaky, MC Shaky Live. That girl. <laughs> so check this out. Okay. I just want to say something, y'all. I am just took a peek at the comments. Why people, let me say something. Okay. So check this out. Guess what? People are entitled, listen. People are entitled to their opinion. Not disputing that. I'm entitled to mine, you're entitled to yours. However, you people are also entitled to not have to be subject to hearing your opinion if they don't want to. Like, I will show you that, but you're entitled to your opinion. If you don't like shaking, or you don't like something shaking say, or you don't like something shaking do, you're entitled to have that right. You don't have to like a picture of this thing I do. But you can't get mad if I don't want to hear about your opinion on my stuff. You can you could you entitled you could supposed to go to your page and post shake it said this I can't stand that or whatever shake it fat ass this or shake it fat ass that that's how you do that you go to your you not finna I'm not finna let you talk about me on my page not for that you're just not finna do it it's just you're not finna do it there's no question about it you're not finna do it. You want to? You don't like what I say? Post it on your page, or post it, or post it on the page of a bitch that don't like me. They're gonna let you post it, but you're not gonna talk about me on my page. Not gonna do it. We're not at that level. I'm going to restrict you from doing that. And then the girls get mad when I do that. Like, ah, turn on the comment. No, you're not about to post about me on my page. You're not about to do it. There's no question about it. It is what it is. Post that on your page, but I can't control it. I'm not gonna let you talk about me on my platform. Bitch, I didn't build my platform so you could talk about me. Bitch, you go build your I built my platform to talk about bitches. On my own. If you don't like me or what I say, cool. And I'm not saying you don't have a difference of opinion. If you don't agree with me, that's fine. I don't have a problem with that. But even when you could, there's ways to disagree without saying, oh, you because this is what the agreement was. You telling me under my comment, well, won't your fat ass get up there and go do something? What? If you don't agree, because they got some people in the comments, I ain't tell them nothing. That was like, okay, well, you know, I, you know, I, I liked it. I like, I was talking. The, the question was about Lil Nas' performance. Okay, whatever. Lil Nas, I did not like the performance. I didn't like it. I don't like the song. And what they had on the red carpet was strange. And that's just my opinion. <laughs> Everybody, but I'm looking at all my cele so celebrities and boom. Oh, Lil Nas ain't that. He did not. Triple to Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson didn't like it. The <laughs> he's the next. No, he's not. He's not the next anyway. Let me say something too, okay? This is another thing too. Everybody, oh, so it's Pride Month, so everybody's supposed to like Lil Nas X, I guess. Okay, cool. But let me say something. Well, I don't respect Lil Nas X. He came out after. He had already got it already. Like, okay, now you come out. But you come out while come out before you do it and see how hard it is. See how see the see the struggle that the bitches that's living in their truth from the get-go. They got bitches living in their truth from the beginning. They struggling. I respect Frida for I respect Nas X and Frida because Frida just came out, bitch, I'm a punk. It is what it is. Lil Nas says fool y'all at first. All the little girls, the white girls, and all it was liking him. Then all of a sudden, no, oh, y'all know I'm bisexual, now I'm a fan. Make up your mind, girl. The reason why, so I don't respect that. I don't respect that. Come out before. Let me know before. And that's why. That's another thing. And then all this. Now I'm a Christian. I believe in God. All this satanic shit. You already got some strike against you being a sissy. And then you want to do the satanic shit too? I mean, look. I ain't finna do that. I'm not finna. I'm not. Be personally. And so I don't like it. And, and, and before. Now before Pride Month. When the song was out. And, all, and he was sliding down a stripper pole. Put, popping his pussy. On the devil. It was a prop. Now it's Pride Month. Oh, we love it. Oh, we love it. So, oh, Lil Nas did it. Did it. Oh, you killed the Lil Nas. Did it. Wasn't you the same bitch that stole that little, that little boy um, idea and made your own app? So this little boy, this little young black boy, wasn't you the same nigga? I See, people gonna tell y'all what sound good, bitch. I'm gonna tell you the truth. I'm gonna tell you the motherfucking truth. 
that shit don't this sound good yes oh little no, nah, nonsense i'm i'm not see they're so scared of getting canceled right now nobody want to tell them that shit was foolish we never did like the song anyway because the motherfuckers bitch first first of all we don't like you fucking with mike i'ma say that Lil Nas X, you did your thing, you do it good, you make a lot of sell a lot of records, okay, good. Bitch, all that Mike, leave Mike alone. I'm not, I don't think Mike was gay. I really don't. That's my personal opinion. I don't think Mike was gay. I think Mike was just fucked up in child. That's what I think. I don't think he was running around. I just don't. I know there's, I know everybody got their own opinion about that. This is my opinion. I don't have no proof. I never looked at this more than anybody else. I don't have no something that this, that, and that. I just think he was just fucked up. I think he was fucked up in child. Bitch been working since he was three years old. He don't know what it is to even have a vacation for real. He always been Michael Jackson. That's hard. Sometimes it's hard being with Chicken. Sometimes I don't want to be with Chicken. So I don't imagine what it is to be Michael Jackson. And he was Michael Jackson since he was three, four years old. Joe Jackson had him out there playing with the bricks. He ooh, ah, ah. Yeah, baby, get me. That's what it is. So, okay. So first of all, little Nas X, Michael Jackson, you are not. That's, that's not even too bad. And I don't even like that. Com I don't even like that. Com Come motherfucking Paris. I don't. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't like it. Okay? That's one. The two part about that is this. Okay? It's the next thing part about this is put y'all on something. Baby. <laughs> Baby. The next part about that is. Every time I hear a song, I think of a gay man sliding on a stripper pole. And twerking a gay black man, twerking on the devil. I think about that. I don't want that in my mind. I can't listen to the song without thinking about man. This bitch was tripping in the video. Now it's his right and far be to do what the fuck you want to do. If that's what the fuck you want to do, I don't care. If you want to twerk on the devil, hey, that's on your body. I don't have to motherfucking like it. I don't watch that. I don't want to see that. And so that's gonna automatically like not me more to listen to the song. I don't want to listen to the song. Let me say something. I am gay. Y'all, some people gonna disagree with what I'm about to say, y'all. But I'm gonna tell y'all the truth. Okay? I believe my creator judges us on our hearts. I believe that. I believe people are different. I believe that too. But this is what I do not believe. Okay? I, the gay people will have you think that homosexuality is okay. Right? They want you to think that. That's the narrative they're pushing right Homosexuality is a sin. You hear me? This is the gay person telling me. I gotta take off my glasses because y'all think I'm crazy when I say that. A, a punk just said that? Yes. A gay person just told you that homosexuality is a sin. I told y'all that. Oh, I'm on limited watch club. Hold on. I'm, I'm, I gotta go this side. Homosexuality is a sin. Right? So the focus should not be on. Yeah. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm all right, I'm going to watch the. Thank you. So listen. So the narrative that gay people will try to push is that homosexuality is not a sin, but it is. They can't get around it. The Bible makes that very clear. The Bible also makes it clear that. Adultery is a sin. Having sex out of wedlock is a sin. Wearing polyester is a sin. And, and, uh, fuck, eating crawfish is a sin. That's what, just listen. So this is what the problem is. It's not the fact that homosexuality is a sin. The fact is, the blood of Christ redeemed us from sin. God knew we couldn't get it because we were always messing up. What's up, King Ty? So what he did was he gave us a plan, an insurance policy to get us out of what we couldn't do. So instead of focusing on whether it's a sin or not, it is. Let's just clear that out. It's a motherfucking sin. We should be focusing on how to get redeemed from that sin. And so people like to say that homosexuality is a sin, it, whatever that's there. Yes, it's a sin. But the, the God I serve forgive that already. He said he came, this was his word told me. I don't know about you, but this is what his word told me. His word say, shake it, you ain't gonna get it. That's what his word told me. He said, you ain't gonna get it. And he was right. Cause my fat ass ain't getting it. 
So instead of me trying to force you to, to sacrifice lamb and cow, because all you're going to be doing is sacrificing cows every two seconds. Okay? So if he, he says, because you ain't going to get it, I'm going to come give you a sacrifice that's going to take care of all that. I'm going to come myself. I'm going to come perfect sacrifice, free of sin, to take care of all of that. Homosexuality, adultery, cheating, lying, gluttony, larceny, thievery, dishonor. I'm going to take care of all that. According to his word, the only thing he ain't going to fool with was blasphemy of the Holy Spirit. That's what the word said. You can argue with me all you want, but the word said I ain't going to mess with that. But everything else, put it on my card. Put it on my tab. That's what the words say. So I don't have a problem with homosexuality because I know everything is a sin. Everything is a sin. Pretty much you wake up in the morning sin some type of way. How many of us got baby daddies and not husbands? That's your sin. Every, all, all, every sin is sin. How many of us going tomorrow, you're calling sick, man, I can't go to work, and then you go out partying with the girls? That's a sin, you lie. How many of us go to self-checkout one, two, skip a few? I'll do it every day. I'm going to do, do it now. So no sin is greater than the other. So, But you can't lie and say it's not a sin because you don't want it to be a sin. Homosexuality is a sin, and it's coming from a gay person. It's a sin. No big deal. It's a sin. Yes, you, 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 you have to know and believe that Jesus Christ, when they say Jesus is my personal savior, that means he died for that already. My sin's been paid for. Well, you can't categorize no sin. God don't hate no gay people. He love them. You know how I know he loves gay people? Because he loves killers. He loves murderers. He loves everybody. He loves everybody. No matter what you did, God loves you. So that's how I know he loves gay people too. He might hate the sin, but he loves. God is not sin. God is not hate. God is love. So he's not sin. He's love. So I got to get up. I'm with the unlimited wash tub with the interior. Sure. I'm unlimited wash tub with the interior. Like, what other tickets will be at? What was that? You have unlimited wash tub? Do you have the interior? Interior one? Yeah. Alright, uh, we still got supposed to get a ticket when you go up there, so just make sure you upgrade. Okay. It's zero dollars. Right. You just got to provide you. Oh, he didn't even, I didn't even, I didn't even wait for him to check it. I just, yeah, it's good, it's good. Okay. Um, I'm not lying to you. You can check my number, I guess. <laughs> I ain't seen no motherfucking number. <laughs> so look. Hold on, I'm coming. So listen. Let me see something. If you trying to... So listen. Like I say, God love, God ain't hate. He know your heart. Okay? He know your heart. You know what it is to live right. Do that, you're going to be all right. You got to believe. That's what it is. That's what your commandments are. Love your creator and love your brother. That's the only thing Jesus told you commandments. Because you know everything else, you wasn't going to get. You do that, you're going to be all right. So don't, but don't come and tell me being gay not a sin is a sin. God damn it. Be, homosexual, 
Now listen, being gay, as far as like you talking about nails and hair, that's not a sin. That's not a sin. You can do the hell you want. But I'm talking about you sleeping with a nigga, that's a sin. If you're a man. Or a woman too, it's a sin. The thing is, you got to accept it's a sin, and then you got to just know that God died for it already. That's the perm. That's the perm. That's what you're supposed to do. Understand that what I'm saying. So when y'all say Lil Nas X, whatever, whatever, it's not a sin for him to be a sissy. Be all the sissy you want to be. I don't give a fuck. But I also think it's a sin to lie. Why is we lying? That performance was not it. I don't know what's who, I ain't even talk about them, girl. I don't talk about them all the time. Come on now. I, I don't care what's going on with them. Sometimes I, I need a breather too. I ain't been talking about them for a couple weeks. I don't know. I don't care. Sister, I'm sorry. You want to hear about them? We talking about something else, girl. We talking about celebrities right now, at least. At least Lil Nas is a celebrity, bitch. Come on now. We ain't talking about that. Let me tell you something. Also, too. Yeah, I don't want to talk about them, girl. We're talking about celebrities right now, girl. We're talking about them bum-ass people, girl. We'll talk about them when it's time. It's not time right now. I need a break, too, some, sometimes, sister. I need a break. I need a break from stupid saying all them sometimes. They are some... They, they, it's, it's just... It's just... I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. So, listen. Okay. I need a break. This is my break. Let me take a break. They dummies. Okay. I don't know what's going on with them. Don't care. I ain't been keeping up. Somebody says some tea across my desk. I say, oh, girl, I don't give a care. Come on, care. So listen. I don't have a problem with Lil Nas X on a personal level at all. But FYI, he used to date my gay son. But it's a whole other thing for another day. I used to, my, my gay son, you gotta really just pay attention. But my gay son and him used to go to him. I don't think they go to him anymore. It was a, some stuff they had. All right. But I will say this. I think that uh, the performance was not. I mean, it was okay. I don't. I think. It, I think too. I'm predisposition to the song. Every time I think about a song, I think about the devil shit. I don't fuck with that. I don't fuck with the devil shit. I never did fuck with that. That's not my thing. We grew up Christians. And I, you know, I know I'm not really a religious person anymore, but I'm more of a person that believe that, you know, I mean, <laughs> I am, look, I am around here consciously being a sissy. So I do not, you know, I need to, it's the, you know, some, I need a few things as possible, bitch. You know, I don't want to just get, you know, I mean, I know God forgives and, and his grace and mercy is plentiful and bountiful as according to the Bible and, and everything. But I don't want to just say, well, fuck. I'm going to just say, fuck it and just do too much. So all that devil shit, I ain't finna fuck with that. I ain't trying to get too... I ain't trying to just keep pressing my luck now. Okay? <laughs> I, I've been a, me, I've been to fuck around that car and get the client, bitch. I get to heaven. I said, Jesus, give me this car. They said he paid it all. And they swipe that bitch and say, hold up. What about this devil shit? <laughs> hold up. Decline my ass. No, ma'am. You're not going to do it. Yeah, and so because it's Pride Month, we don't want to talk about that this song, the symbolism for his video for the song was definitely, I think, I think, devil worship type shit. Not saying it's devil worship. What can I say? Because I don't know. But you're shaking, you're twerking on the devil. Like, what the, like, I don't know. How, how could you? Because if I'm twerking on a nigga, bitch, my pussy worshiping that dick. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. I'm worshiping, bitch. You know, so I, if I'm twerking on a nigga, like my nigga, if I twerk on him, bitch, you better believe, bitch. I'm, I'm, in my mind, I'm thinking, Beyonce dance with you. Tonight I wanna dance with you. That's what I'm thinking about. So, uh, it's a sex. Why does gay have to be synonymous with sex? I don't know. So, um, so yeah, you, you, you twerking on a devil, that just ain't sit right with me. And so every time that song play, I, I change the station because I hear, I hear that in my mind. I see, I see that visual. That visual is still in my mind. Now, he go to BET Awards, do the performance, do all that stuff with Michael Jackson. Everybody, he kissed a man. Everybody happy. Yay, ooh, gay pride. Hey, he killed it. No, he didn't. If this was a regular rapper, you'd be like, it was I. Right. He didn't give us a wow. He didn't give us a, a, a Destiny Child BET Awards wow. He gave us a, okay, you're doing something. 
How little baby doing? Second, little baby is fine. Little baby is fine. We good. Head over the bigger. You hear a lot about us. We think about starting a YouTube channel. That this is what they're pushing on our children. Yeah. Well, you have a. Now see. Now listen. Parents. 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 Now y'all talking about they forcing the narrative. The bitch got a right to be a sissy. You got a right to be a parent. Don't let your children watch it. Don't let you turn the TV off. Turn the phones off. Take them from them. You can't get now. You can't get mad because that's what they're doing. You get you get mad at yourself at that point. Turn that fucking TV off. You not finna watch this faggot ass shit. That's on you, parents. That's not on him. They not forcing no narrative. You the parent. Turn the phone off. You pay the phone bill. You pay the light bill. Them children, don't, don't. Now listen, this, he got, listen. I don't like it. I have a right to my opinion. It's some, there was some faggot and demon ass shit and I don't fuck with that. That's true. I don't, I don't, I, but, at, but I'm not going to say he don't have a right to, if he want to dance on the devil and, and write his ticket, bitch, that's yay. More power to you. Suck more demons dicks. I don't care what you do. Suck dicks on whatever you want to do. But don't say that this is the narrative they're forcing on your children when you could do the most powerful thing and it's turn the TV off. Unplug that motherfucker. Put the power card in your room. Your children shouldn't have a choice on watching that or not. You are the parent. You have the choice. Turn the motherfucker off. Turn it off. No, you didn't have it on TV years ago, but it's on TV now. So you got to do one or two things. You got to either turn the TV off or let them watch it. Ain't no such thing. Play, 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 uh, clue and checkers and chess and all that with the journey. Gays everywhere, so should they not just watch anything? Hey, they got some non-gay stuff. They got some non-gay stuff. Or, and I'm not saying don't just let them see the gayness. I think you should make them aware and talk about, well, but this is a different world than I grew up. I would have to talk with my child. And I had to talk with my child and tell them I was gay. So, I would talk to my children and say, listen, you're going to see some stuff. And it's about acceptance. I'm not saying that you should tell your child to be hating gay people. But I get what you're saying. Like that nil nine stuff, you might not want your... That's, I, that's certainly not appropriate for children. I don't think. I don't think that. I agree with you on that. So I'm not disagreeing with you. I don't think I'm disagreeing with you. But I'm saying, as a parent, you have to step in and, and, and be like, okay, look. You should... Have, that, you got it. That's just what it is. Because they're not... Let me say something. Gay is running the media. You hear me? Y'all hear what I say this now? Gays run the media. Gays run the media. So, seeing this gay stuff, you're not going to stop seeing it. They was doing this a long time before. Y'all just didn't know it, okay? They just was hiding it. Uncle, they say Uncle Phil and Uncle Carl was gay, bitch. So, at the end of the day, bitch... Why was all the black dads gay? Bill Cosby a pedophile, black dad. Or whatever he did, I don't know what, but he drug and women, sex crimes, sex trafficking. Black dad, gay. Look at it. Not gay, but, you know. So look at what I'm talking about. So hey, hey, I'm just letting y'all know. It's not something new. Y'all talking about like it's just brand new. It was a little more undercover back then. Let's say that. Being gay on TV and being gay and all that stuff, that's not new. We are just... It's just being uncovered. Let's say that, okay? Y'all want, y'all want. Let's let's agree with that. Let's let's talk about that. Girl, they say Uncle Carl was gay, girl. Uncle Phil ain't. Uncle, I say Carl Winslow ain't Uncle Carl. Bitch. Big guy. Piss they say he was busting Steve Urkel. <laughs> I don't know, girl. <laughs> but uh, no. <laughs> I ain't got no tip for these people because I don't even have no motherfucking um. Uh -huh. I don't care. No, do I got I might have a couple dollars again. Let me see. Hold on. I don't never have pay. What if put the tip?
thank you. Where you put the tip then? Okay. Okay, thank you. So this is my problem. How you doing? So let me tell you something. This is my problem. All right, you're good to go. All right, thank you. Here you go, brother. Oh, thank you so much. No problem. Okay, you too. I got this skill. Like this. Damn, I gotta go to the motherfucker. Four thirty. Shit, I gotta go to Blue Bay. Damn, the you said the gays bash the straight women. Girl, you gotta show them kids something else. And all you gotta just really talk to them and let them know the world that they live in. They're people that are different. You have to have them conversations with them. This motherfucker clean. I love him. Who is this clean? I like a clean car, bitch. So yeah, bitch. It's the next week. And I gotta go to the Well, I gotta go to Bunny anyway. Because I have to go to the nail shop. Because I broke a nail and I'm gonna get it prepared, bitch. My boyfriend do not like my nails. Yeah. Oh my God, he do not like. It. I broke a nail. He hit one of my nails, and bitch, it was I was in, I was in real life tears. Then I hit this one a day. Oh uh, no no no! I broke this one, and he was like, um, talking about some fucking congratulations. Who did sell your car? Uh, it was just a car wash. I have the unlimited wash of wipes or whatever the fuck it is. It's clean. This is cool. It needed this. Which it needed this. It smells good too. Why would a child be up to tip at? Well, it's not a school day. It's summertime. Them children be up. Now, I'm not going to lie. Them children be up. Them children. Ah, but I tell parents all the time, bitch, don't let your children watch shake. I cuss too much. And I talk about dick a lot. This not what I be talking about is not appropriate for kids. What I talk about is not appropriate. Your children shouldn't watch me. Little kids like me though, because I guess I'm just so big and colorful and animated. I've, I've seen like a yeah, they be up. But okay, if you saying you don't have no problems, if you can't turn the TV off, you can't turn off the this and that and all that. Turn off the Wi-Fi. Unplug that bitch. I unplug it. I unplug it if that's the case. But if you if you don't want to unplug it, that's cool. Don't unplug it. But I tell you what, you need to have that talk with them. You can't expect TV to raise your child the right way. You can't TV not gonna do it. The internet not gonna do it. It's not gonna do it. Shake it is not gonna do it. It's not gonna do it. You have to do it. That is your job. You lucky fuck. Girl. And then they got some great teachers out there. But fuck, they don't even pay them enough. So you talking about the kids see on TV like it's the TV fault. Bitch, turn that motherfucker off. Or if you don't want to turn it off and let them watch TV, cool. You gotta talk to them. You gotta have them talks. You gotta have them explanations. You gotta explain. Look, this is what you seen. You're gonna see this black man shake his ass on a motherfucking twerk. On a motherfucking, you're gonna see this man twerk on a motherfucking, uh, what do you call it? You're gonna see this man twerk on a, uh, devil. Okay? That's what you're gonna see. I wish you didn't have to see that, but this is what they symbolize. Now, I don't agree with that. And, and, but God, you know, as my child, you ain't gonna agree with it either, bitch. But, uh, <laughs> but, my child ain't gonna fuck with that. Okay? <laughs> But bitch, you got the motherfucker. You got the motherfucker. Go ahead and get on and, and 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 have them conversations. I don't like the performance. I did not like the performance. I did not like the outfit. I did not like it. I just didn't. And so for all these celebs to be talking about like he ate it, he really didn't. If you were compare, you were saying that because he's gay. It's Pride Month. You scared you gonna get canceled. So you wanna like Lil Nas X, and that shit bothers me because that's fake as fuck, bitch. I respect a bitch to tell me the truth. What's going on, Kayla sister? How you doing? 
I respect a bitch telling me the motherfucking truth. Don't motherfucking lie to me, bitch. You didn't like that. I know you didn't like that. You one of my favorite celebs. I've been following you a while. I kind of am a, a tribute to know what you like and you don't like. Y'all did not like that. Y'all saying that only. Only because he's gay. Only because it's Pride Month. And only because your black ass scared of being careful. That's it. That's it. Say what you really feel. I respect it. I might not like it. I might not agree with it. But sometimes we got to just tell the truth. If everybody told the truth, we'll be much better off. Let's just tell the truth. The song stupid to me. I never get a song change because I when I started I saw the video before the song. I was watching the, I heard about the video before I really heard it got into the song. So the video made me watch the song. When I saw the video, I was immediately turned off. So I never got a chance. The song never got a chance. Next part about that is. So the song to me not even that hot. Next part about that is you just doing too fucking much. The performance was okay. I said mediocre. I said it was mediocre. It was okay. That's about it. The song was okay. You always believe that Diddy is gay profit, so girl. It wouldn't surprise me. I didn't like the performance, it was okay. The outfit to me was trash, and I'ma see what the fuck's on my mind. I'm saying what every celebrity thinking. Every celebrity that posted, it was wonderful. Shout out to Meg, when the um, Hall Wars, that was cute. I fucks with that. Shout out to Cardi B, for letting Quavo put another dick in her. Must they put another baby in her. What? Quavo offset one of them. Girl, all of them same. I said Quavo offset Quavo all of them. Girl, that's all, they're all one of the same to me. they all one person, bitch. they all in my mind. One person, girl. What the fuck? That's all one, all, all of them, all of that little click right there, that's all just one person, bitch. <laughs> Y'all know what Migo I'm talking about, girl. I'm too old, girl. I'm getting older, bitch. All of them, one Migo to me. All of them, it's just one of them. All of them is just one person bitch. so Offset got a pregnant again congratulations Cardi B the, I, got a, I got a word of advice though okay y'all might not like my I do got a piece of advice Cardi B do not breastfeed this baby you gonna get a bitch nightmare the bitch gonna grow up scared to death <laughs> do not get this boy or girl don't don't breastfeed him. bitch them titties there jeez am I the only one that see her and then see the titty bitch. <laughs> yeah, it's, just, uh, it's like kicking up my head, bitch. Like what the fuck? That's a, it's only one bitch. Don't breastfeed. Similac your way has home over there. <laughs> I don't cook. I don't clean. Let me tell you, I got this right. <laughs> don't be in here about breastfeeding. Show no. He, your nigga don't like to suck titties. Can't be. <laughs> I don't, and I don't even know how that's possible, bitch. I got to get my titties sucked now. That's my new thing, bitch. I love it. <laughs> shout out to her. Shout out to. Sh uh, okay, uh, you know what? Let me just say this. Okay. No shade. Not. Look, this something else happened in the awards. They was talking about. And I saw it and I was like, what? If I was the only person, like, what? The City Girls performance was trash. I, didn't, I don't even think I just saw that. But I did see JT Shay hit uh, Riley and say, bitch, you wide back, bitch. <laughs> I like Riley. I really like Riley. I like her. I like Riley. I just didn't like that she hired a dummy for on site. Like, that was just stupid. What kind of shit? Like, oh, girl. Girl, for real. Like, what kind of bonehead ass decision was that? 
Shout out Super Saiyan. <laughs> so after that, I was like, damn, Rob, I thought you were smart. Am I I've never been there. I think I'm going to try it. I'm going to let my husband home. So I like rides. I thought she was, that was just, I didn't know. fuck me up about the whole awards that I just don't understand and, and y'all just gotta make me understand it. how many Lil' Kim fans we got in Sip Nation Sip Nation are y'all Lil' Kim fans oh, there's nothing wrong with that people, people like who they like I don't got no problem with Lil' Kim but then she was like okay who you wanna do a versus battle with and the first name she said was Nikki You don't, sister. You don't want to do a versus battle with Nikki. No female rapper wants to do a versus battle with Nikki. Lil' Kim cannot do it. Nikki has too many hits. Nikki has too many hits. For real. Lil' Kim is motherfucking delusion. If she thinks she can do song for song with Nicki Minaj. She's Delusion. She's on crack or something. Got to be. You are not battling this woman. This woman has more. Kim, you got one zone. Two, maybe. You got a few features, but you got like two songs. I come from Brooklyn, that song, and I'm like one of those. Them other songs y'all talk about is not hit. The, all the rest of the songs you you got somebody featured on your song. Nicki got songs y'all tripping, tripping. Nicki got hit songs. Excuse me. Yeah, I got a man. Ash, is that all right with you? It ain't your song because child, he too busy stealing somebody come. It could have been, but you know. Mm -hmm. Your song want to play, play games. I wasn't for the food. All the fucking. How many licks? How many lips is that song? I remember that Okay, she got it. That's really just two. She got like three. She got the other song I like. She ain't got that many songs. What's... Okay. She she got hit songs for days? What they is? Let, who said that? She got kept... She got kept... Come on, Purpose. Let's go live. I need to know. And for every... I'm going to do hit... You got to pull up on me? I live in Bay Rouge now. Where you at? It's just an error. What song? I was in. I'm Kim Error. Nikki is on my children's error. Oh, she won't come up. Kim is my error. Kim wasn't popping like that girl. That girl's popping, coming with songs. Missy, Foxy. Bitch, what you talking about? That was coming with songs. I'm Kim Error. Kim had, Kim had a song or two she was on. Oh, try to be silent. No problem. No shit. Bow Wow had more hits than Soldier Boy. And that was the worst verses. Girl. I looked at two minutes of that bitch. What's that song? Let's look it up. So come out of come and tell me. Let's look it up. Let's look it up. I pay for. Hold on, my boy. Hold on, bitch. 
So why she want to do a versus battle in a different era, different style? Hey. I don't know why they hate Nikki. She hating the wrong one. Nikki ain't, ain't killed her career, bitch. The fact that she can't rap killed her career. Suge Knight killed Kim career. Cause she didn't cause Suge Knight took Biggie from us and so Biggie couldn't write for that on the more. What? I say what I say. I say what I say. That's who killed Kim Career. Don't get mad with us. Get mad at Suge Knight, bitch. What? What? Get mad at Suge Knight, bitch. Don't get mad with us. You win. Your ghost rider was gone. Puppet couldn't write you a song. Puppet couldn't write. Only thing Puppet knew how to do was stamp other people's songs and, and, and put a and put a you know, and put that one little drum line that Puppet got behind. Like that one little motherfucking bass line he got that boom. Yeah, that's the only thing Puppet. Puppet biggest claim to fame was motherfucking sampling into me, bitch. Puppet couldn't write no motherfucking songs, bitch. That was Biggie, bitch. So it, get mad with them. Don't get mad with us. She paved the way. No, Mo. How could Kim pave the way for who? How could you pave the way for somebody that that was went further than you? Nikki paved the way. Kim could pave the way because she didn't cross over. Kim. Demonstrate something. Who paved the way for a bomb? Who paved the way for a bomb? Who paved the way for a bomb? Obama politically, who paved the way for him? Politically speaking, Obama was a lawyer. He was a uh, uh, he went um uh, and was in his state level representative. Then he got. He didn't even go to U.S. representative. He went to, he became the senator from Chicago and then the president of the United States. That's his political career. Who paved the way for me? Lil, Lil Kim biggest hit. Songs Mag frequently mentioned on the web include Magic Stick, Crush on You, Lighters Up, Panty Numb Club, and others. Okay. Three hits. I can't take that from her. How does she pay the way when she didn't cross over? How did she pave the way when she didn't do with the, the people in the, she's doing they, she never crossed over? Kim never was a pop person. Kim, how could she pave the way when she didn't went further than her? I don't understand that. How could you pave the way? And okay, what the fuck do you get a, a, a fucking cookie for paving the way? The fuck? What do you want Licky to do? Give her a, a, a cookie? I'm trying to figure out what do you want to say. Kim is a legend. Nobody's this movement. What is it that you want to do? Get a bitch a cookie? Oh, you paved the way. But she didn't pave the way because the bitch never. No, the waters Nikki have been in are uncharted. They've never been charted by a female rapper. Perfume line, pop song. Nikki had a pop hit. No rapping, singing. When did, when when did Kim sing? And if you tell me about some fucking colorful wig, bitch. That's your bitch. That if you tell me that's paving the way, I'm a, I'm a block you. I, you come tell me about some motherfucking colorful wig, bitch. How the fuck that's paving way? Cause you want colorful wig. I'm trying to figure out what paving the way she did. She did. Lady Mama not that was across the way. That's not Kim's song. She was a feature on the song. That's Christina Aguilera's song. Yeah, she would have grabbed it for it, something like that. Yeah, she crossed over, blah, 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 or, uh, as, as far as that song go. But I'm talking about sustainability. Nick has crossed over. Nick has super bass, 
Pound of Love, Turn Me On, three number one hits on the pop charts, back to fucking back. What the fuck is you talking about? On pop charts, white folks. What are you talking about? Mickey was all in the fucking, uh, what the movie she was in? Sex in the city and everything, bitch. White people, where, where Kim was that? Where was Kim at? How'd you pave the way and I'm doing stuff you ain't never done? I'm paving the way for whoever come behind me. I'm doing shit you've never done. The only thing I got from you was a colorful wig, bitch. You don't own colorful wig. You can't mark your, what? You copyright colorful wig? Barbershop too, yeah. What, 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 what was Nicky doing? What, what? Y'all sound crazy as fuck. Kim got three songs. This nigga got three. And if you say Wayne and Drake was right for Nicky, okay. Biggie was right for Kim, and you know that. Who don't know that? Who don't know that? Nicky will start singing on the track. When, they, when Kim have a song, she paved the way for her that too. Girl, come on. Kim is a Kim is most definitely a legend. I will never say Kim is not a legend. I, you'll never hear that come out of my mouth. Kim is very much so a legend. She's very much so legendary. There's never a question about that. Don't think I'm saying Kim not legend. Kim is a motherfucking legend. I'm agreeing with you wholeheartedly. You have no arguments for me on that. Kim is most certainly a motherfucking legend. It's not even disputable. Okay? Kim is definitely a legend. But what do you, but she's not motherfucking, she's not, do, she cannot do no verses against Nicki Minaj. She is not, and as far as paving the way, I'm trying to see where the way was paved. Haram Neville. Y'all know who that is? Haram Neville. Go look it up. Nicki got music to still buy. Oh my God, Sid Nation, we're not having this discussion. It's not Kim versus Nikki because there's no dispute. Kim, Nikki is just, Kim, did, Kim was around the right people. I don't even think Kim would rap that fucking good. But you, I mean, she know how to, she know how to beat her. She, I think she performed better than she rapped if you ain't here. Hello? What's going on? What's going on? How are you?